All right, everyone, we're back, and LaDonna's on her honeymoon. But, uh, she's missing her new groom. I'm not sure how that happened. It was probably, you know, I must have clicked something wrong. So, yeah, her, her new husband's not with her on her honeymoon. But, to be honest, that's probably the way LaDonna will prefer it. Let's get her checked into her room. Let's find a good bed. Oh, it's so dark in here. She wants to visit the museum. Oh, but she cannot visit her hubby. Oh, no. My bed. Okay, bitches, that's my room. No one touch. So, let's see. LaDonna's already wanting to go to the museum. So, let's go to the museum. Ooh, wee oui, wee. Oui. It's how you say so romantic to be here without my hubby. There's an art museum, so she wants to go there. First, let's go and get her some supplies. Relics, uh, general store, bookstore, cafe. Let's go to the general store. We need to get her some things just in case she wants to go on an adventure. Who knows? She may find ancient ruins and tombs and shit like that. Even though if it ruins her shoes, the adventure will be over. Does she have her car with her? Or does she have to take a taxi? Or oh, she takes a limo. Okay. She's like, I'm going to town in style. Y'all can't stop me now. Ow. Wow, they drove her around the corner. Literally, her room is like right there. They drove her around the corner. That's kind of awesome, though. She wants to buy a tent. That's exactly what I was thinking. Because uh, she met sexy man. <gasps> Ooh, speaking of meeting sexy men, hello. Charming introduction. Hello, big boy. Ew, you have a nasty sneeze, bitch. Oh, she already wanna send him a oh they have yeah, we got things in common. You got P and I got a V, let's put them together. I forgot besides my husband there's another man at home waiting for me. Uh say la vie. Yeah, let's get to know each other. Um What's your sign? Do you want me? Tell me you do. He's in a relationship? Aww. Is his, like, chick somewhere around here? Because I don't give two shits. I don't see his bitch. Oh, we're compatible. I knew it. Ladon's kind of rep re compatible with every man she meets. Oh, yeah, let's woohoo right there in the tent, babe. Dang, we don't, you don't gotta love me and I ain't gotta love you. How am I friends with these people already? She wants to sing karaoke with him? For what? Come on, follow me into the tent. He was easy. We don't even love each other. We're just friends. And he's like, sure, I'll get in this tent and do you. Let's go. That's all I'm about to say. Yeah, get in here. Come on. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Woo. Relaxing, huh? That was relaxing. Need to get another tent. Bye. Imagine a tent so you could just have sex on the go. Or like, get to a club, there's nowhere to do the guy. Just pop down a tent and be like, let's go. You know? That's awesome. Ah, LaDonna's like, I don't give a damn. I walk around my underwear. <laughs> I need a tent for sex on the go. Yeah, give me a tent. Oh, she got expensive. I want the ex nice, expensive tent. I like nice things. Oh, yeah, I want that. That's cute. Food, high quality. Thank you. You never know. She may need to go on like a little adventure and she may get hungry. Shower in a can? No. Buy items. Why are you laughing at me, bitch? You don't know me. Now, let's see. Let's go to that museum. And then maybe after that, we'll go to the winery. That sounds like fun. She's still striding with pride. That's making her go slow, though. I wish I knew who his wife was. I would tell her, like, he cheated on you with me. And it was kind of awesome. Oh, I can tell her. Where is she? And in fact, she must be around. Because I know her and, like, we're acquainted and stuff. In fact, I'm going to go to the museum, ask her to meet me at the museum, and then tell her about me and her man. If that's an option. Because I know it's it's option sometimes. Be like, listen, I'm going to tell you about your man's other relationship. 
it involves me. Now where are you going? Are you walking to the museum? Girl. Yeah. Oh, this one is fast. It's faster than I think the one you get with university. Oh, it's beautiful. I don't appreciate art. I appreciate good looking men. We need her to muse at the museum. What is around here though? Yeah, artifacts and whatnot, a bed. And that's true. You go to a museum, they will have beds in there. Be like, this was the furniture of whatever. That's kind of cool. Like, like MoMA. Like, MoMA has nothing but, like, beds in there. Like, what's in the basement, though? What's down here? Seriously, it's a basement that leads to nowhere. I don't believe that for a second. Oh, there's a door. Can I open said door? Yeah, they're like, it says no interaction available. Yeah, go through door. There must be a way to unlock it then. I don't see like any uh holes in the wall to punch. Secret codes. I don't know. Ooh, I wish I could get behind there. Oh, there is a hole. Can't inspect. Oh wait, we gotta destroy this man's marriage first. Hold up. That's his bitch. Hello, bitch. About to ruin your marriage. Let's see. Can I tell her? Hilarious Gree. I'll tell her a joke that's like so funny. <laughs> and then I'll tell her something really sad. Now I'm totally happy that I didn't take my husband on my honeymoon with me. <laughs> She's gonna like tell me some boring story. Become friends? No, that won't happen. Yeah, we're like the best of friends. Yeah, I'm gonna tell her. Yeah, I should tell her how I like her husband. He's so sexy. I'm just gonna confess my attraction to her man. Like, your man is sexy and he's amazing in bed. Oh, that didn't upset her at all. That that didn't, like, upset her at all. Wow. Um, I'm gonna tell her again. Did you not understand me? I, I, I do things with your man. Wow, she really just don't care. She's like, oh, you do my man? That's great. Maybe it's a French thing. Anyway, we're not really friends. I really actually don't want to hang out with you. So, yeah. What's this of friends? Can I hit you up for like 20 bucks? Yeah, whatever, bitch. Give me some money, bitch. You're wasting my time. I thought I was going to upset you and you're happy. She told me no. Then you are not my friend. Oh, yeah, we're no longer friends, right? I'm cool with that. Three's a crowd. Yep. Three is most definitely a crowd. Oh, uh, now I'm no longer friends with these people. Oh, is this some uh, major scandal? I don't even know what it said. Oopsie deuzu. I guess the scandal got out that I slept with her man in a tent. Well, um, oh, am I being arrested? Oh, hell no. I ain't got time to be arrested. I'm on vacation. Damn, I get arrested in foreign countries? Well, this is the first time I've been ar arrested while abroad. Damn. I will take my ass away. Oh, but you think I'm sexy too, though, officer. Bad time out. Yeah, we had a bad time. Ooh, you sexy. Who the hell are you? I'ma look up your number, baby. Pull up to my bumper, baby. Oh, she's hungry. She needs to pee, take a shower. After, I mean, after she get out of jail, obviously. Where is the police station anyway? They probably just gonna take me home. Yeah, cause there's no police station. So you all glitched out. You all jacked up. You can't do nothing about it. Ha ha. Seriously, you need to take a class and have fun. I'm thinking of a four-year degree at minimum. Wow. You're dead. So you don't get to say who has fun and who doesn't, bitch. You're dead, bitch. Let's visit the winery. Let's drink some shit. Let's hop on the Vespa. Bye, cops. Can't hold me down. Ow. Ooh, look at the field. It's so pretty. Big, ooh, there's a big old rock behind that house. Buy a bottle of nectar. Sure, why not? Bye.
No, I mean, I'm gonna buy something. Not bye bye, like I'm gonna shoot you. <laughs> uh, where's your finest bottle of wine? Give me something tasty. Pinot Grigio. I want like a really expensive bottle. Damn, they got real expensive. And I can afford it. Let me get wine. I should have a wine cellar. That's so fancy. Ooh, and wine man. No, I'm not making no damn wine. I have my wine and poured it. Plasma fruit. Dang. They have wine for vampire? That's cool. That's real cool. Fine. Seven bottles. Because I got it like that. Oh, bitch, you gonna boo me in your store trying to embarrass me in front of all these people? Oh, hell no. I was about to shoot. Oh, and am I just taking bottles? Wow, I just took a... Yeah, we get free bottles. We pop bottles, bitches. I'll drink by myself. I don't need y'all. Got no music up in here. This place is boring as hell. Whatever. Did he call me a bitch? He did. No. Hell no. He That dude called me a bitch. He did. I heard it. He was like, boo, bitch. I heard him. Well, he taking a bottle, so he's probably going to be coming around this way. Is he just, like, taking bottles? Because he's not even tasting. He's just taking. No, I took out that wine. You don't get to have a bottle of wine. I'm enjoying my wine, though. Drinking your life away, drinking your wine. I'm very upset with this man, though. He did call me a bitch. That's just downright disrespectful. Goodbye, sir. You need to die, sir. You you called me out of my name. That's not cool. You don't know me. Oh, there's a fridge here. I'm hungry. Mooch, quick meal. I want a salad. Uh, am I getting arrested? That man's not even dead, though. Listen, sir, you can't actually arrest me. So how about we talk about this? The man's not even dying. You shouldn't even arrest me. This is unfair. Like, my first day in France, I'm, I've already been arrested twice now. That's not right. This is totes unfair. See, you can't even keep me. Let me get back to the lodge. Goodbye, cop. I ain't got time for this. That man didn't even die. I was falsely accused. Bye. I drove right through your cop car. You're powerless to stop me. I think LaDonna should check out the adventure board. Maybe she should go on an adventure. Because apparently the locals don't like her. And that's not good. Yeah, we know you gotta go to the bathroom. You need to eat, though. Affair? <gasps> What? Oh, not that kind of affair. Hee <laughs> hee. I'm looking for a daring soul who is willing to provide some assistance for for ample award. Oh, nice. I like money. <laughs> if you are willing, please refer to me. Okay, so we'll do that. Well, um, we'll do it in the morning since it's like nighttime and whatnot. So let's give her the salad. Get her in, uh, in the shower and whatnot. Get her in bed. So we can go on our adventure in the morning. Huh, now it's the morning. Well, Donna can wake up now. I'm gonna have her eat something for breakfast and then we're gonna go on and have our little adventure. See what this ample reward is. Donna, like, you're not in your own home and she's still walking around her underwear. She's actually gonna cook. I told her to make mushroom omelets. Don't cut off your finger, girl. Don't do it. She didn't cut her finger. LaDonna, <laughs> she's not great at cooking. She only has like three cooking skills, but hopefully she won't burn this place down. I don't even like eggs, and for some reason, like, I'm curious now how this is actually going to come out. <laughs> like, I want to taste it. It looks ugly and disgusting. No, never mind. I take it back. I hate eggs, and I don't, I don't care if LaDonna can't make an omelet. It doesn't look that appetizing. What she wants to do, visit the Nectary again? Uh, we can just for the lulls and the points. We don't got a lot of points. Those actually look good. I kind of now take back what I said before. <laughs> I wish I could carry this food with me in my pocket, because I don't want to put it in the fridge for these other people to have. It's supposed to be my food. Anyway, eat up and then report in. 
There you go. Nice and full now. Let's go see this woman and find out about this treasure. I'm glad um, the people I killed had nothing to do with this mission. Hopefully they won't feel like I did something wrong. <laughs> like, I hate you. I'm not helping you. Alright, now tell me about this treasure, bitch. Huh, okay. Oh, ancient coins. Oh, I guess we could do that. Stop booing me. You don't know me, bitch. You don't know what my life is like. FYI, it's kind of awesome. But still, don't judge me. Oh, there's that guy I did, and then I killed his girlfriend. Hey. No, I killed his wife, actually. He was married. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Let's go on an adventure.